All right, back to today for the Bracken. And not on the good camera this time, uh, just on my phone, because I forgot the other one. Uh, but yeah, as you can see, we've got the quad bike. And uh, it's just, yeah, we were never gonna make much progress just by whipping. And now actually most of the Bracken's too, it's too, uh, too advanced, too old to whip now. So yeah, we've, uh, we haven't actually got a Bracken roller. We've just uh, pulling uh, <laughs> an old, Tire behind the quad bike, so we'll. Uh, it's kind of working ish, but we are planning on getting a, a bracken roller at some point, probably for later in the summer. But we just thought we'd just come and do something now, just while we got a bit of time. Uh, so, yeah, let's just go down and uh, check it out. All right. Well, you do it if you do it twice, then it it might work better. Yeah, I mean, well, it's pretty messed up behind where I've been now, isn't it? Yeah, because you're like looking. Yeah. It's sort of all lying down. But it's lying down and not really broken, has it? Hopefully. Yeah. Let's give that a go. So you might call that. So you've gone one way with it at the moment, and then you're going to come back. So it's all lying that way, and then you come back the other way, uh, and hopefully that will actually break the stems. Whereas now they're just kind of lying down, most of them. Well, it's doing something. Yeah, now the. See down here, now they're really broken. Yeah, because you, if you don't break them, they're just going to carry on. Yeah, that seems to be a lot better. Yeah? I don't know. Yeah, there's a lot more that are now broken. You can see it. Maybe we should have had two tyres next to each other behind. We need them going in opposite directions. Yeah. I think. Just think if we're doing more width at once. Have you got another, have you got another tyre? Are we, well, how much chain have we got? And the, uh, the bike might start to struggle a bit. It's not a very strong chain, that's the problem. I, yeah. I, I, I expect it might break. Oh, right. Well, maybe just stick with the one. I, I got a rope as well. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, so maybe we, maybe we put another tie on behind. But, uh,. Yeah, some progress anyway. All right, so we spent uh, a couple of hours with the quad bike here. And as you can see, it's uh, pretty smashed to bracken if you compare it to um, over here. What am I pointing? Yeah, here. <laughs> it's uh, quite a lot thicker. That's on the on the main slope, steep slope, so we can't get the quad bike down there. Uh, and if I spin round, it'd be enough up here and over the top as well. Uh, so yeah, that was just a bit of a extra uh, compared to what the uh, doing it manually, whipping the bracket. Just uh, showing what you can, kind of, how much more you can do with a uh, with machine, basically. Uh, kind of almost made me feel like it was worthless doing a whipping, but got to got to try these things. Uh, we're probably going to have to do something a bit more extreme on the steeper slopes, so whether we. Uh, get some sort of strimmer or potentially the, the the bamboo canes are a bit are not really strong enough when it's really thick but maybe we have something a bit a bit thicker like uh, a wooden pole maybe we can make some progress there but it'll be uh, pretty slow going whatever right so that's it for this video uh, if you're enjoying watching don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in the next video